Okay, so here I am on the owners page and um, I'll click on Ken since he's the first one. So when you're going here, you have two options when editing. You have the visual right here and then you have the text. Um, so there's a bit of code that I installed right here, or I guess I pasted right here. And all it is is basically the short code um, that we're referring to for buttons. So if you want to rename the button, I just put read next insight because you call them, I think, business case insights or whatever. So read next insight. And then I found the URL for Eduardo and I just pasted it right here. Um, and so on the visual side, you'll see it as like a hyperlinked text. But if you preview the changes right here, you'll see do, 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 um, that it's a button right here. So make sure that as you're editing these buttons that you check the URL for the next person. And so that's what I did. With each person I, you know, found the URL and stuck it in there. Um, for each person, I think that's what I did with the, the R process page too. So right here if you click on discovery. Um, next step, training. And then I also did like previous step. I don't know if you wanted that or not, but it's there just in case that they want to do that. Um, and there we go. Okay, so let me know if you have any questions about that, but um, you can look at any of these pages or any of the owner pages on the, the text side. So make sure that you're doing it on the text side right here, and then just copy and paste this and then change out the, the information.